Mr. Shebang. Your average gamer. What is going on, everybody? My name is Mr. Shebang, and I'm really, really excited to be here on Thunderstruck Gaming. Um, it's awesome that Thunder has made this channel to help other people out. You know, it's hard nowadays to get noticed, and even when you do get noticed, a lot of people like to label new people trying to get into the community as money whores. Like, oh, you you just want the money, man. Oh, get out of here, man. Fuck you. Um, but, you know, it's awesome that Thunder's giving me the chance to, you know, show you guys who I am, expose myself a little bit. No homo. Um, I don't want to expose myself to young children. Um, but, you know, enough of sucking Thunder's dick for today. Uh, thank you again, <laughs> Thunder. But, uh, who I am, um, my name's Brandon, you know, my gamer tag is Mr. Shebang. Um, any website I go on, if I have to create some kind of username, it's always Mr. Shebang. I don't know why. Um, I just like the word Shebang and Mr. in front of it. I'm Mr. Shebang. Um, I'm 19 years old, though. I attend community college in Los Angeles, California. And, you know, I just like to have fun, man. You know, what my channel is, like, really centered around is, you know, I just like to talk about things in the community you know, things in life, you know, have discussions, intellectual discussions, whatever it may be. I don't really talk about the gameplay very much, um, but, you know, I just try and have fun with my subs and, you know, just interact and not take this too seriously because in the end, it's a hobby. It's not a job. You know, anytime I get annoyed with something, I could just not do it, right? I can not post a video for a couple of days if I'm not bothered because it's not my job. Um, but enough about that. What I really want to talk about is how... The whole community, you know, all of us, this whole YouTube called Call of Duty community as a whole, as one entity, we need, for lack of better terms, to calm the fuck down, <laughs> okay? And what I mean by that is, this is not that serious. This is supposed to be for fun. Call of Duty, YouTube, all this stuff is for fun, man. Why are we freaking out and, like, acting as if it's our lifestyle, you know? You know if Call of Duty doesn't get fixed, I'm jumping off a roof tomorrow. It's not. You know, it's not that important. It's just a game in the end. It's a game just like any other game. If you don't enjoy a certain game, why continue to play it? You know, respect to Thunder. You know, he doesn't enjoy Modern Warfare 3. More power to him. Why Why not not post it anymore, you know? If he doesn't enjoy it, he's not going to do well in his videos, right? He's not going to put up entertaining videos because he's not enjoying his time spent on the game. All he's going to do is complain. So... He does the smart thing, stops playing. You know, I get killed by Dead Man's Hand three times in a row. I turn off the game. I put in something else. You know, I play some Mass Effect. I play some Batman. I play some Homefront. I play some anything else but what's making me angry. I don't let it continually, you know, get to me. You know, it's great if you put some variety in your gaming. Because, you know, a lot of people who complain constantly about Call of Duty are the people who don't do anything else. Like, they don't, I don't want to say don't do anything else, but they don't play anything else but Call of Duty. That's psychotic. You need to always, you know, have variety in any kind of your life. You know, if you're in college, right, you don't want to take four math classes in one semester because overload of math, man, you're going to lose your mind. Well, you want to take some political science. You want to take some, I don't know, history, communications, whatever. You don't take everything like the same subject four times. You don't take four courses that are all this, about the same thing because you know what? That's boring. You know, you'll lose your mind. Same thing. You don't just play Call of Duty all the time. You play different things, you know. And our community, right? Our community is really young. You know, we are. Like, there are older people that watch Call of Duty videos, and I'm not discrediting any of them. But I want to say that 40 to 60% of the community is between the ages of, like, 12 and 16. And in that, at that age, you're so impressionable, right? So if you're watching a commentator, you know, whether or not commentators like it, no matter how much of a following you have, you have influence over your subscribers. You have influence over what they think because you're putting ideas out there, right? They're listening. They're absorbing it, and they're thinking about it. Now, whether or not they decide to follow it or believe it, that's up to them. But it doesn't matter. You still have that influence. So when you have a channel completely centered around, you know, just complaining, you know, I've seen, you know, it's great if you address concerns, right? Like, it's great whenever there was, like, some kind of crazy patch that made the FMG9 shoot, like, eight times faster. That's great. Make a video about it. Address the concern. But don't make eight videos in a row about how you hate the Type 95. Because if you, you know, if you watch something where someone's complaining constantly, that's going to that's gonna start getting to you, right? If someone complains about the, I don't know, the FAMAS and Black Ops, right? 
and you see you watch 10 videos that day and all of them are saying hey fuck this from us guy ghost oh my god you know without any comedic value right like thunder like likes to joke around when he gets killed by ghosts like oh my boy ghost bitch in the corner he, like you know like that's funny you know he puts some like a little bit of humor into it instead of just complaining like hey fuck this guy Arr! i'm gonna kill him you know so if you watch eight videos in a row of some guy completely just blatantly complaining you know no value in it other than complaining and then you get on you get killed by some guy using famas and ghost and second chance you're gonna be like oh my god i fucking hate this game i'm so angry and the same thing goes to like when we like to complain to bowling or when we liked to complain to bowling because he's gone you know god bless him he he had to deal with this he was the pinnacle of every bad thing like every bad thing that came about in this community would get thrown at him so you know it's great that we have social media to allow us to like connect to our developers and tell them like what's going on with the people that actually play their games you know give them real insight but some people like to take this too far take it a little bit too seriously you know not be so calm and be like hey bowling i'm gonna shit in your mouth tonight if you don't fix dead man's hand or i just got killed by a guy using the type 95 and fmgs i'm gonna slit your throat tonight i'll see you you know and he got so many death threats that the guy couldn't go to gaming events that's terrible man you know let's calm down you know in the end what i'm trying to say is we all need to you know take a step back like i said it's great to look at yourself in a critical manner and you know decide whether or not you want to continue going on whatever path you've set you for yourself and right now the path for this community it's a little bit hostile man i'm kind of scared that like one day some guys just gonna snap and fucking find my address and kill me i don't know what's gonna happen but you know on a lighter note you know that's just what i wanted to say I want to thank Thunder again, you know, giving me this opportunity. If you guys enjoy my content, don't feel obligated to, you know, subscribe unless you really did enjoy it. You know, come by, check out my channel, see if you like what you see, and then subscribe. You know, there's nothing worse than a dead subscriber, man. Um, but, again, thank you, Thunder, for the opportunity. I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys thought about, you know, the community, how everyone needs to just calm the fuck down. Um, but, yeah, I'm Mr. Shebang, guys. Again, thank you so much, Thunder. You know, I'm sorry for sucking your dick so much, this commentary, but it was necessary. <laughs> oh, God, guys, before I make myself sound even worse, I'm out of here. <laughs> Bye.